Salut tout le monde et bienvenue à Stinkweed MTG. Mon nom c'est Gabriel et je suis super excité à être ici pour jouer plus de magie avec vous. Je suis ici joigné avec mes amis Dan, Brendan et Andrew. Et nous sommes tous préparés à jouer un peu de EDH avec vous. Je m'excuse, je suis pas certain comment on dit ça en français, spécifiquement en Québec, en usual. Euh, mais non, euh, je fais ça en français. Je vais changer en anglais pour que mes amis ils m'arrêtent de me regarder comme j'ai un troisième œil sur le front. So, now I'm going to go and explain a little bit of the deck that I'm going to be playing today. Yay! Yay. <laughs> Ancon requirements fulfilled. Yay! <laughs> Not like I apologize a few too many times there, but it's on the camera. It's, 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 it's fine. It's fine. fine. All right, so the deck that I'm playing today, I'm playing uh, with Karlov of the Ghost Council. I'm very happy to be playing this. This is one of the first uh, commander decks I ever built when I started playing Magic. Um, the concept of this deck is pretty easy. It's just a whole lot of creatures, cheap things that'll gain me life, some, like, like Basilicus creature, things that have extort, to make Karlov boost up, because every time I gain life, he gets two plus one plus one counters, and eventually I can remove those counters to exile things. So it's very oh, control heavy. He's so scary. Once he gets that, that many counters, oh, mm -hmm. he's very specific. He's Once just like, he everything is gone. Real quick. Yeah. Once he's like a 26, 26 with like lifelink and unblockable, he's pretty much... <laughs> and he's removal, which yeah. is crazy. Exactly. Um, and um, is it permanent removal? Uh, it's only creature removal, specifically oh, though. If it was it, like permanent removal, that would be insane. Well, Still yeah. pretty fine. Uh, <laughs> tap, tap two, remove your land. Oh, God, did better vindicate? Yeah, um, holy shit. Yuck. So other than cheap creatures, then I have like bigger payoff strategies, things like polluted bonds, which gain me insane amounts of life, especially in a game of EDH, when people are gonna be playing a lot of lands. Uh, if I can't get Karloff to get enough uh, counters on him, then obviously I have other removal strategies, Merciless Eviction, Wrath of God, uh, Day of Judgment, whatever it needs to be. Um, and the main other pieces are things that will give Karlov unblockable uh, or like, you know, protection from everything, such as like Prowler's Helm, so he can only be blocked by walls. Uh, I think there's only one wall in that's going to be in this game. Oh, there's going to be plenty. Oh, there's a few. <laughs> I thought you only had Steel Wall in that deck. Oh, oh buddy, no. I got I got another one in front of you. Oh, is Shield Sphere a wall? It counts as a wall. Okay. That's insane. Are we moving on now? Is that it? Um, and the last things that I wanted to mention about this deck are obviously in black, you need like big, chunky strategies, so things like Necropotence are really good oh, yeah. for drawing a bunch of cards. Yeah, yeah. And then That's if I need one. alternate win conditions, I've got things like Sanguine Bond or uh, Vampire Blood Lord to uh, like, just do the drain strategy. Are you running the combo with Sanguine Bond? Oh, uh, Exquisite, Sanguine Bond, Exquisite, Exquisite Blood, Blood, right? Yeah. yeah, of course. Uh, <laughs> Another card that I course. bought when it was cheap and is now worth like $60 or whatever it is. Yeah, good man. Um, I, the, the, other the other part about your deck that oh. I always remember though is there's like, just with the extort and the tiny little, like you have a couple guys in there that just gain you one life on your upkeep and two counters on Karlov. So it's just your upkeep always ends up being 10 counters and horrible. <laughs> yep. Uh, who wants to go next? I'll take the reins. All right. Um, so last time I had a theme, and this time my theme fell apart, so now we're just playing decks I own. Great. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that's a good way of explaining that whole story. It's the best theme. <laughs> Uh, so we have Phoenix, God of Deception. Um, I have lost this card more than any other card I've ever owned, despite it being in a bright green sleeve. That's also a story. Well, it's a god of deceptions. I know. He <laughs> deceived me more than any other card. Um, <laughs> so the deck is what you'd expect on the Phoenix deck. It's uh, walls and mill, right? What, is, what does Phoenix do? Oh, explain. I'm going to explain him, right? Um, so he's a um, five mana, four seven, indestructible. Uh, comes with a god cause, so he's an enchantment until your devotion, which is the amount of uh, black and blue mana costs uh, in casting costs of permanence you control uh, add up to seven. Then Ooh. he becomes a true creature. And then uh, while he's in play, all my other creatures have the ability to tap to mill a target player for uh, an amount equal to their toughness. Yes. Which uh, is why you run all of these three mana zero sevens and stuff like Shield Sphere. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the big so uh, when Gabe said there were no walls, uh, no, there is only walls. <laughs> In fact, apart from walls, I have a couple clones, a couple utility guys, but it's like 80% wall here. Or bomb. Um, got something better than Prowler's Helm. Yeah, we got... <laughs> so, like, walls, that's the meat of the deck. Um, we got Blue Disruption. This, that's where my board clears are coming from. I'm running Evacuate, Cyclonic Rift. Um, I found my Cyclonic Rift. Uh, all of those things. Um, there's a couple combo wins in here just because it's mill and I'm in a multiplayer format. Yeah, it's fair. I and, love that uh, card, by the way. That's like yeah. one of my favorite cards. 
Um, I do like the Traumatize and um, Frank Sanity. Sanity combo. I've got Mind Crank and the Demir Guild Mage. Um, so there's a couple of quick wins in here if I can pull them together. And some just big cost sorceries that can really mess things up. Oh, um, with performance. Yeah. <laughs> um, with the slightest hint of grave digging, because I'm putting all of these creatures in graveyards, I might as well, you know, take the good ones back out. Makes sense. Um, and the other one is I just put Intruder Alarm here because I own three copies of Intruder Alarm from childhood, and I am uh, proud of that. I hate that card. So it's a good much. one. I hate it. I hate everything about that uh, card. Yeah, <laughs> that would be me, rough they, for me. <laughs> they won't let me have Paradox oh. Engine anymore, but uh, this thing's fair game. Yep. Um, we did date the episode. We dated our last ones. We were talking about the London Mulligan. All oh, right. Episode one, That's London true. Mulligan. <laughs> <laughs> So, Not you know, today. it's it's mill. I'm taking cards out of decks and yeah. hopefully taking the good ones out of the graveyards and not pulling aggro or launching attacks. Right. Um, Brendan, what's your game? Uh, I built a god tribal deck. Um, we opened our box of Modern Horizons and Joe pulled Morphon. He graciously traded it to me. And now I have a deck full of gods. Um, to get all these gods online, I've had to th fill the deck with a lot of board clears. Uh, like Divine Reckoning, nothing too crazy. Some, some, there's some good ones. Uh, Morphon himself makes my gods cost one less of Wooburg. So Fist of Sons and Joda do yeah. the same thing. So they're, they're really good because then like, I could just play my gods for free. That's not bad, I've heard. Yeah, mm -hmm. playing my hand for free okay. is like, is okay, I guess. <laughs> I, this is like my favorite deck you've ever built, by the way. It's cool. And uh, the rest of it is just kind of like synergy for tribal. Call of Kindred, Descendants Path. They let me, on my upkeep, look at the top of my deck, and if there's gods there, I get to play them for free. That's all right. Cool. That's, oh. that's decent. Off tribes. Yeah. <laughs> Kindred Summons, an amazing card from Commander Absolutely. 2017? 18? I think so. 18? 17, I think. I got it in Cats. Either way, yeah. We'll find out. Uh, oh, choose right. a creature type, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal X creature cards of the chosen type, where X is the number of creatures of that type I control. Yeah. So if I have six gods, I just go get six more gods. Yeah, that's okay. Uh, that's, that's filthy. Yeah. Yeah. That's my deck. Why am I five colors. I've never played five colors before. Yeah, it's it's, it's really it's cool. Own, <laughs> it's fun, isn't yeah. it? Uh, what do you got, Dan? Uh, so this week I'm playing uh, Crash the Blood Braided. Okay. So it's, uh, it's an aristocrat style deck. I've, uh, I've, I've had decks with Crash as the commander for a long time. He was one of my first commander decks. We call it a Sack Lunch because uh, the deck eats everything and we're sacrificing everything. So pretty much it's just made of four parts. The first part is uh, Crash. Uh, the next part is creatures that want to be sacrificed. For example, Mitotic Slime, which splits as it goes down. So 4-4 four, four into two two twos, which in turn split into four, or two one ones each. Mm. Um, we have Sacrifice Outlets, like Ashnod's Altar and Goblin Bombardment. And then we have Blood Artist Effects, cards that care about when creatures die. Uh, and that's pretty much the whole deck, it's pretty straightforward. I'm going to be creating a lot of tokens, so I really hope that uh, you don't have Intruder Alarm. That would suck. Um, uh, other than that though, I'm hoping to just synergy out everyone and, you know, kill my own board to kill the rest of you. Nice. All right, so now that we've introduced all the decks and we're all pretty itching and anxious to get started, uh, we're going to take a quick smoke break and then come back to it. Uh, I guess we'll see you in five. <laughs> Yeah, we're we are. When we're all good to go, we're all set oh, yeah. with our hands. All got good sevens. Okay, yep. uh, I will draw since I'm going first. Mm. Oh yeah, we all got good game. sevens. We did. <laughs> Don't. Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play this Godless Shrine tapped, and I'll pass the turn. <laughs> do 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 do. Um, John Cena. John Cena. Oh yeah, you can't bleep that out. <laughs> <laughs> that Still was wall. my nope. theme song. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Begins. <laughs> Untap, upkeep, draw. Mm. Uh, Temple of Triumph, scry. Mm. Mm. Bottom that. Interesting. Mm. Best part about playing a five color deck, you get all the oh, good five the color card lands. on the bottom. May I go? Yeah, go. I'll draw my card. Mm -hmm. Then I'll do my untap and upkeep. I'll choose the order, thank you very much. Okay. Sure. Uh, Cinderglade tapped, go ahead. Sure. Um, You're not drinking, Drew. Is that because not. that was the glass that was found in the garbage? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, now it is. Well, 
It's okay. We disinfected it. We're fine. Yeah, I cleaned that. I scrubbed it pretty good. I'm gonna play a command tower and then an Ajani's mantra. I don't believe and you. <laughs> <laughs> beginning, of my, beginning of my upkeep, I gain a life. Go ahead. It's a very special card. It begins. Yeah, this is what I was talking about with the weird little incidental life gain that adds up once he has four triggers of it. Yeah. yeah. Four life returns is not bad. It's okay. It's like you're like some kind of wiener guy. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know we were going that far. I mean, that's a little serious. But he needs to stop. That's, a, that's an allegation. What did you do? Oh, I'm sorry. I played a swamp and then played this charcoal diamond. It's been a while, guys. So. Sorry. <laughs> I forgot I'm on camera. Go. Yeah, we gotta explain our plays. Yeah, no. I thought I was just playing a game of magic with my friends. No. Nope. I mean, you're doing that too. Everyone's watching. <laughs> Except for Gabe. Gabe's not Do I right. have to? Hey. 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 <laughs> Don't let him know. Hi. 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 Draw. Top up keep. I am draw. Gabe's here because he can speak French. Mm. He can speak French and he is here. I'm gonna play <laughs> uh, Temple of Enlightenment and I get to scry. Oh yeah, that's the other thing. Dan gave me the great idea of putting temples in this deck to fix the mana curve, so I don't have to spend like a billion dollars putting that on top. A billion dollars on this deck. I mean, temples are good. Temples yeah. are good. Temples are great. Temples and painlands. Here you yep. go. I, I think I'm running all the temples and painlands I can in this deck. Well, it's like you can get there in Commander without having to like blow your load on lands. Yeah. Uh, Sulfurous Spring. Nobody's, like, nobody's expecting to die on turn three. I will three tap two mana. Most metas. Goblin Bombardment. Uh, I can sack a creature to ping something for one. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, untap. <laughs> Draw. Um, yeah, where where are you guys two mana off. enchantments? I mean, I have a one mana creature. I'm okay. Uh, I'm gonna tap two and I'm gonna bring out Carl. Uh, oh, I gained a life on my upkeep as well. Me, me and Steve Wall here. We'll <laughs> Steve uh, Wall. Then I'm going to do an Orzhov Basilica, which bounces a land to my hand. I'll return a command tower to my hand. You may go. Okie dokie. Um, ooh, that's a card that you can play. You can. Um, Believe in yourself. Oh, okay. I'm going to play this Evolving Wilds. Tap three black. I'm going to play this Dread Shade. No, stop believing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dread Shade is a 3-3 three, three that has... Uh, I can tap a Swamp to give it plus one, plus one. Swamp breathing? It yeah. has... Uh, swamp breathing, Bob yeah. Breathing. Swamp breathing, right? Embiggen for black. Embiggen. <laughs> I like embiggen. <laughs> Michael? Yeah. Yes. Day of the episode. One, you're upkeep! I'm gonna crack this for an island! Ah! Oh, okay. I'm using Evolving Wilds wrong! Okay, I'm done okay. using Evolving Wilds wrong. Jerk. <laughs> <laughs> uh, slowed me down. I'm gonna tap three and play this Herald's Horn naming gods. Oh. Here you go. Uh, my gods cost oh. one less, and at the beginning of my upkeep, I can look at the top card of my library. If it's a creature card of the chosen type, I can reveal it and put it in my hand. I'm gonna play a Firelit Thicket, a filter land of sorts. Hmm. I don't Drew remember um, he shouldn't um, lean back on his chair. Then I want a second sacrifice ailment, so we're gonna play a spawning pit. Okay. Get in the pit. What does uh, the spawning ahead. pit do? Oh, I can uh, sacrifice a creature to put a charge counter on it, mm -hmm. and then I can pay one generic and remove two charge counters to make a 2-2 two -two spawn artifact creature token. Oh, cool. That's Go ahead. a roundabout okay. uh, way of doing that. Uh, no, it's fine. Gets Up, the job done. Yeah. Upkeep, I'm gonna gain another life. Uh, triggers Karloff, so he gets two plus one plus one counters, which I will use that die for. Uh, and then I will draw. Uh, ooh, that's a decent card that I kinda wanna play. Um, what? I know, it, it's ridiculous. He already has more life than all of us. He has a 4-4 four, right. four and more life than the rest of us. Uh, I'll tap for three and I'll play a Phyrexian Arena. So, mm. beginning my upkeep, I draw a card and lose a life. Oh, so uh, they're, they're countering each other out? Oh, it's unbeatable. <laughs> <laughs> I just draw an extra card, what's the problem? And you still get the life gain trigger. Uh, I'm yeah, gonna pass the turn to you, Drew, go ahead. Ugh, yuck. Yuckasaurus. <laughs> Ew, yuck. yuck. I don't like that. All right. I don't like that. Oh. Well, I'll walk it all off. And I scout from under 10, I don't walk it. Becky, please. Thank you, Jennifer. Oh, my God. I don't walk it. Nah. Nah, I don't. Uh, we're gonna play the big fee man. Okay. okay. I see. He's sitting out here. I can now tap my creatures to mill people. You sure can. Uh, you got Dope. two big boys. Yeah, he's also not a real boy because devotion is only five. Go. Oh, only five with two cards. Only five with two creatures. So you know we're in, okay. Dread Shade's kind of good for that. You know. Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, ooh, not gonna not say a creature. Not condition. showing it to you. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. Wait, that's probably good. Mm -hmm. Probably. Unless it's like a kindred summons, then that sucks. Okay. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna play the Smothering Tithe. Oh, oh, I don't like it. Here I go, Dan. See. 
Uh-oh. Uh, untap. Playing green this time. Um, upkeep. Uh, draw. Trigger. You gonna pay two? Um, how many cards do you have in your hand? Like a billion? Uh, not less than three. Five. Yeah, like a billion. Um, yeah, you can have your treasure. Yay! I'm gonna put a token on this mother. I'll take a pain off the Sulphur Springs. And I'm gonna play a Golgari Germination, which is an enchantment that whenever a non-token creature I control dies, I got a 1-1 green sap rolling creature. Okay. Go ahead. All right. Uh, on tap, upkeep, I'll stack it like this. Ajani's mantra goes off first, so I gain a life, then Phyrexian Arena, so I lose said life and draw a card, and then I will draw how, my draw stack. I never heard of that card before. Weird, because you played a Sapperling deck. I played for a while. the Golgari Sapperlings deck, and I've never seen that card before. Uh, I, don't, I mean, that sounds like a you problem. Yeah. <laughs> dumb or something. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't want to say it. Uh-huh. Uh, okay, I'm going to tap for three, and I'm going to play a Read the Bones, which is scry two, draw two cards, lose two life. Nice. So scry. I'm going to put both of those on the bottom. I don't really need either of them. Oh. Uh, and then I will draw two. Oh, okay. um, um, you. Oh, draw right, trigger the, from drawing your first card on the turn? You, you can get your Smothering Tide trigger. Okay, and then also you drew two. So then you get two more triggers. It's actually four. I have four in total now. No, oh, you yeah, should have five can, in total now. One for me and four from him. Yeah, because of the Frexian Arena. <laughs> yeah. Sick. What do I have to do with You have to pay two you have to pay from two the Naka okay. Treasure. Um, Understood. I am then going to play a Swamp and a Nyx Bliss Ram, which works much like an Ajani's Mantra, except it's a zero five 5 enchantment creature. Cool. Um, I believe I got a discard. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I'm gonna have to discard at the end of my turn. I will get rid of this Plains Drew. You may go. The end of your turn. I'm gonna mill Dan for seven. Yep. Oh wait, no. One. So I think Dan might have two, creatures seven. for me to take. Three, four, five, yeah, six, seven. seven. All right, those are some good ones. Uh, creatures is a deranged tournament and a murderous red cap. One guy makes squirrels. Yeah, I know. It's got echo though. I don't think you can pay the green. No, I cannot. Cool. Untap. Upkeep. <clears throat> draw. Not running green on your Phoenix deck. Um, Come on. What are you thinking? Draw. Yeah. I'm. Give me a second. Yeah. Still. Still turn. Fuck it. Trigger I'm paying for smothering time. Oh, okay. oh really? Yeah. You madman. <laughs> <laughs> Only need three mana this turn. I don't care. Well, I mean, when I, I don't even need that. One, I was like, he's just gonna get two treasures. This will be fine. And then you drew four cards. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Mr. Dinkus over here. <laughs> I have to get all my draw spells. I also, I didn't have to discard <laughs> that planes. I, I miscounted. Um, I'm going to play this Disciple of Deceit. Uh, Disciple of Deceit has inspired. So yeah, if, when it becomes untapped, I may discard a non-land card and then search my library for a different card with the same CMC. Mm. What's your devotion now? Seven. Ooh, Phoenix is a, is a real boy. Mm, you don't say. Mm, that's unfortunate. Phoenix is a real, real boy and can now block and attack like a real man. Take a minute if you have to, it's but fine. it's your turn. It's fine. Well, the problem is, no, I was no, in no, the no, middle no. of the explanation, so now we go. Do you want to go again? Do you no. Because <laughs> I want to leave that in. Okay, my turn. Right, yep. Untap, <laughs> upkeep, draw. <laughs> uh, it's Bantu, the glorified. He goes into my hand and I get to draw another card. Sure. Sure. Yeah, sure. Sure. Right. sure. Sure. Not a fan. Sure. That's fine. That's fine. Sure. Don't worry about it. Sure. Sure. Um, did you? Sure. Oh, you did pay for smothering tight. Yeah, I did. Oh. Sure. Temple of the False Gods. Sure. God Tribal. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm gonna boop down one of these for a black. Don't like it. And what? A green and a white for painful truths and draw three cards. I see. Okay. Yep. You also take three, right? Uh, do I? Well, that's where the pain part yeah, comes from. Yeah, I do lose. I do lose three life. Not so painful truth. You just draw the cards. <laughs> <laughs> this is commander. I'm and gonna bring it up, Brendan, because we both keep doing it. What? Uh, I keep looking over at your Stop board. Stop it! I don't your look turn. at my hand. I, I don't look at your hand. Okay, I'm not trying to, but <laughs> I'm looking. Don't look at my hand. Okay. I'm looking at your hand from here. I'm sorry. I don't trust. I can't help it. My glasses are very. Ref- they're so reflective that I can actually reflect Into... off of you and see your hand. <laughs> No, no, it's, that's, that's why I took my glasses Three, off. Three, four, five. Is, see, now I can't see anything. It's just black. Oh, I'm gonna play Marari's Wake. I um, see. You have a lot of very good enchantments and spoopy. Whatever, it's yeah. meta, dude. Whatever. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm worried. Don't worry about it. I am worried. It's too late. Uh, Is it a permanent or a land? What? Land. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't get double treasure. No, that'd be crazy. It's not like a mana reflection or something. <laughs> What else am I doing? I don't know. Uh, one, two, three, four. 
Uh, Ilharg, the raised boar. Yeah, that's right. Yep. We've seen him before on MTG. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty good. Luckily, Blightsteel Colossus, not a god. Yeah. <laughs> Don't have to worry about one shot, Robot. You're going uh, Unta. <laughs> not again. Uh, draw. Please, not again. I will pay the two. Wow. Oh, I'm not casting very much with three lands, so. <laughs> uh, I'll take one and play a Carrion Feeder. Oof. Oh, sack outlet active. I, First I, creature of the game. Yep. <laughs> uh, pass the turn. All right. Uh, untap, upkeep. I'm going to gain two life off the next release Ram and Ajani's mantra triggers. Do uh, you pay for. Oh, he hasn't so done a card head? yet. He has, he's going to oh. do it later. The rest uh, of us do. Now I will lose a life and draw one card off of Phyrexian Arena. Pay the, pay the, pay the troll tool to get into my hole? <laughs> Are you, you, you going to get out of the hole? Uh, hold on. Um, I don't think I'm out of my hole. I can't. I, I, I can't. Can. So no, you, oh, can, you can get it. Yes. You can get both of them actually because then I'm going to have to draw another yes. card. Why, Gabe? I'm sorry! I have the things rest I got to do! Are working, are working hard here. Why? Um, I'm just getting mana. I this feels only, like trickle down economics. You I and I are doing all the work. Raise boy. And they're getting all the... I don't know. I'm just a raise boy. I'm sorry I milled you, Dan. Okay. No, this uh, is okay. This, will, this might have actually slightly helped me. A little okay. bit of mill is good. Uh, well, get, it, can get, it can get the gas going. Black, yeah. green. Yeah. Pretty much. Uh, I'm gonna tap three for a commander sphere, which is just more mana for me. Break it for cards. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, and then playing a planes he and... He might do it. Uh, That's yeah. <laughs> That's true. He might have done it. Not quite scared of Drew just yet, so I think I'm gonna go on the offensive. I'm gonna do Gift of Orjova on Karlov. He now has flying plus one plus one and lifelink. Jesus. Okay, that's um, bad. And he's currently in 11 11. Uh -oh. So. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be the bad guy right now. Um, I mean. Upsetting my spaghetti. Please don't upset my spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> my spaghetti is already upsetting. Uh, Brendan, you're actually pretty scary, so <gasps> I'm gonna swing at you for 11 in the air with oh, Karlov. Response. Yes. <laughs> on attacks. Break three of these treasures. Generous gift, you get a 3-3. Three, three. <sighs> He's being generous though. Yeah. I could be a not generous gift and give you less than a 3-3. Three, three. I understand, I totally understand. Does anybody have a 3-3 three, three token? Uh, I think I do, I'll be able to get it oh, in, yeah. in, 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 in between turns. Okay, You can sure. just be like one of these, ha, cut. Uh, and it's... we're back. Yeah, we uh, Drew, you may go. Thank you. At the end of your turn, Gabe, I'm going to mill Brendan for seven. 10, 14, 17, 18. Oh boy. What? Yep. You know for 18. <laughs> Why? I added all the numbers together. Oh. <laughs> That's what they add up to. 10, 14. And then he pumped the shade oh, by one. Okay, one. I pumped him for one. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Anything with okay. flashback or anything like that? Nah, but Beast Within was the last one. And that's good removal. That is good removal. Aww. It's like only removal. Yikes. I'm gonna move to my untap step. Cool. And I'm going to untap my cards. You're gonna pay then... two? I am! Well, you get to see the card first, but. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna draw it and I'm still gonna pay two. Fair enough. Oh, uh, yeah. No, yeah, no. <laughs> um. Oh, I forgot to use Disciple of Deceit for anything. Well, that's my fault. Um. Oh right, uh, the untap trigger. Eh, it's yeah, okay. it's a May trigger. Yeah, it's okay. I'll survive. I mean, I won't. Galvanic Juggernaut. Oh, oh boy. Oh, is that another beefy boy? No. Uh, no Galvan well, kind of. Galvanic Juggernaut attacks each turn if able. Uh, however, he's probably not going to be attacking. I can tap him, right? Um. He does not untap during your untap step. Well, this creature sounds pretty bad so far. But uh, whenever another creature dies, untap Galvanic Juggernaut. Yeah. Oh. Hi, Dan. Hi. Uh -oh. How's it going? That's not good. It's, okay. it's not intruder alarm. I mean, I only have three sack outlets, so this should be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna need some... Go, Reddit. Okay. We'll Maybe we can together kill somebody. I think you and I are a bit of a team at this point. Nice. Our decks are synergizing. Uh, not a god. So I don't have to show you. I won't. I mean, even if it was a god, you don't still. I mean, you just nope. you just draw it regularly. No. Okay. I think you can anyway. No. Sorry. I didn't. I mean, I'll I'll stay back. Should I get it? I mean, it I can get it that frame to you. No. To try and not flick mm. my cards is very difficult. D d d doing this was okay, but I could really hear the flicking. <laughs> I know. I noticed it too. 
It, it was like it was a sport. To be honest, uh, you sent Wyatt around the loop. Uh, he was lose. I he was walking in and out of my room, trying to track down a sound that was going on in there, uh, and trying to figure out if it was <clears throat> happening outside his headphones because he couldn't figure out what the fuck it was. Okay, okay. Uh, how does that work again? Everybody chooses one creature, destroy the rest. <clears throat> Easy. I have one. I guess I'm gonna choose my mixed fleece ram. Wait, wait. There's probably responses. Question. Yes. What happens if I? Phoenix gets killed here, right? No, no he's indestructible. indestructible. No, he's indestructible. Yeah, okay. We're good. Yeah. Uh, are there any responses? Um, I'm tapped out. I'm I mean, your creatures aren't. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Dan. The purpose of your deck. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Um, hey, Gabe. Yeah, what up? Melon Actually... Melon 17? Yeah, let's spread it around. All right. Uh, Melon 17. Five, six, Let's see if one nine. of you is something in your in your deck for me to use. 10, 11, 12, 6, 7. Okay, so what did you get? You got the very first card hey, was my please. exquisite blood, which is really unfortunate. Uh, you got a Defiant Blood Lord. He's actually decent. He's a 4-5, yeah. so he's a chonky boy for you. Sometimes you roll the slot machine uh, and you hit it. You got a lot of my removal. You got my Doom Blade, and you got... Um, uh, my murder, uh, Chalice of Life, Dawn of Hope. You got my, you got one of my rats, uh, and that's about yeah, it. Yeah, okay, yeah. that's that's good haul. D yeah, there was definitely some good stuff in there. That's a good haul. Yeah. Uh, okay, so now all other creatures Sneaky except for oh yeah, sorry. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I guess I have to fire Blood Lord now. Uh, yeah, sack the beast token. Yeah, uh, I'm choosing Carrying Feeder. Okay. I'm choosing Galvanic Juggernaut. That's fine. Fair enough. I assume you're choosing Ilharg, the Race Borg? Yes. Ilharg, the Borgor. Mm. Borgor. Por qué? Por qué? Something you wish you could do? No, it's fine. Okay. Por quoi? Staring intently at me, you just knew exactly what you were doing. Por quoi? Senor? Hmm. Senor indeed. Pourquoi, senor? Hmm. Pourquoi, Kino Sabi? <laughs> I have no idea what that's a reference from, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's, <not. laughs> it's, it's, sort of a, it's sort of a weird roundabout reference to John Wayne. <laughs> just kind of a man himself. Mothering Tithe. I'm going to crack one of my treasures. Temple of the False Gods gives me three mana, and this Plains gives me two. Yep. I'm gonna play Morphon for six. I don't like it. Okay. Uh, and then I'm gonna play... Mm -hmm. uh, Shock. Afara for one colorless, and Bontu for one colorless. Not a fan. I'm also not okay with this outcome. Um, and then I'm gonna play Ban Panorama for my land for turn. Okay. And then I'm gonna play... Phoenix for two colorless. Hey, wait. Let this rule? No, because it has to be the same player. Yeah. Right? Yep. Both sides. You're thinking of the old, old one. It's fine. Back when Phantasma Lunge was the best removal card in the world. Don't yeah. worry about it. <laughs> Drew used to play fair magic. Um, he never really lined a singularity to someone. No, never. <laughs> mean. Gabe, Melia for six. <laughs> 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 I'm, shouldn't it be seven? Because he's getting one one. Because he's a god. Yeah, he's a god. See, so eight actually. Or yeah, seven. Seven, seven, seven four, four. Five, No, no, eight. Because uh, the Mario's. Oh right. yeah, eight. You're my hero. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, you got to turn. I was like worried about playing Mill today because sometimes playing. you like bring Mill out and you're everybody's just kind of like, uh. Yeah, it's the Mill game today. Oh boy, now there's two Mill decks going on. I don't know how to respond to this. I, you got my Mortify, in. you got Cabal. Oh, uh, fucking in now, boy. You, got my, in for you got my Rogue's Passage, which is one of my main win cons. <laughs> so you don't, guys no longer have to worry about Karla being uh, uh, unblockable. I mean, yes we do, just not with Rogue's Passage. <sighs> how do I organize these? I guess like that, that's fine. These are real creatures. Mm, totally. totally not. Oh yeah. Here go, Dan. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw, um, I will not pay the two, you can have your treasure. Sweet. I'm gonna shock myself off a of Blood Crypt. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize we're playing Modern suddenly. Finally! <laughs> <laughs> I have the mana! Oh shit, this is on the table the whole time. <laughs> well, has it been in frame the whole time? 
probably. I uh, really hope not. Oh man, it costs like six hundred dollars. We can just to, blur it out. To blur that they don't. Out. They don't care. They're never gonna watch it. It's fine. <laughs> don't say that. <laughs> don't ever know. Some representatives just at his house. I care. <laughs> um, I like you guys. James. Oh. James Reddy, I really like your beer. So let's cut a deal. <laughs> Uh, let's see. I actually have a choice to make. It's weird. Um, we're gonna play an old Corpse Jack Manus. Oh boy. If one encounter would be put on a creature I control, put twice that many instead. Sack it to carry, Peter. Nice. I will not do that. <laughs> um, Morphon's a big guy, eh? He's like a 7-7 seven, seven right now? Yeah. Mm, seven, yeah. Seven boy. Uh, pass the turn. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna untap, uh, upkeep, I'm gonna gain two life off of these two enchantments, then lose a life and draw a card for Phyrexian Arena. Brendan, you can get your token. Ooh. Dope. Uh, and then I will draw another card. Do I get another token? No. You're gonna pay two? I will pay the two. Jesus. I'm going to tap my Orzhov Basilica for that. Okay. Uh, soul Ring. We've played against Smothering <laughs> Tide one too many times. Dude, Smothering Tide? Best card in Magic. Oh yeah, but just no. putting that out there. Best no. card in Magic, Smothering Tide. I don't know about it. I mean, Land Tax is also a really good card, to be fair. I enjoy playing Land Tax. I mean, Ancestral Recall is a pretty good one. I don't know. Um, so one, two, three, uh, four, he's got nothing five, on it. Ancestral Recall trusts three cards? Yeah. You kidding? That's three treasures for me. <laughs> Go ahead, play yeah, all the recalls true. you want, buddy. Um... I don't have any land. That thing land comes with like the wind calling Why didn't they make food right? better? I feel like food and treasure should have been on the same playing field, and food is just like strictly worse. It makes me so mad. I mean, it's not strictly worse. Eh. I don't know. That depends on what kind of synergies they I, have. I do yeah, like but... the, like exactly what you just said. I do like the synergies with food yeah. where you can sacrifice food to creatures or enchantments to get things that I mean, are better than just. Only like life. half the set's spoiled right now. We mm -hmm. still have another week of spoilers. Oh yeah. Stop dating us. What? <laughs> you were just talking about talking food, talking dude. about spoilers. <laughs> I think we just need to resolve that at this spoilers. point. They're reprinting all the Eldrazi again. Yeah. In Zendikar. Sure. Spoilers. Business. Calling it now. Okay. okay. That's what we do here, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah, no. Hot takes. Uh, hot takes. Hot takes and cold soup. Do you think the Eldrazi are coming back, actually? That's a good option. I mean, yeah. uh, uh, yes, but not those cards. Yeah, uh, I, I think eventually. I mean, Emrakul's just trapped in the moon. Yeah, but on Innistrad. No, eventually the moon. Yeah, yeah. Uh, eventually, like, uh, eventually one of the sets, the moon's gonna come crashing down. Ooh. Just like <laughs> yeah, well, 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 no, I'm just like yeah, because. <laughs> Spooky. <laughs> We're okay. No, but it's think, the Hildrazi. <laughs> <laughs> She's here. He he there he is. Ulamok himself. But like, if, if you think about it, the crashing moon thing is just really good from a card art perspective. Oh, that would be really yeah, cool. Be right? Fun. So I think you, I think eventually he'll come back down. Right. Hot take, here's what's gonna happen. Blood moon, they're gonna make a new blood moon, then it's gonna be specifically that. Oh, that'd be a really nice blood moon, actually. Wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, no, all right. just pen pre peeking around the corner, yeah, just like, like, I'm here. Okay, now that I'm actually gonna play my turn. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I'm gonna tap for five for a Sun Scorch Regent. No, take Ooh. it back. Uh, which is whenever an opponent casts a spell, put a plus one, plus one counter on Sun Scorch Regent and gain one life. Um, then I am also going to play a Scoured Barons, which enters tap, and I gain a life. I will pass the turn to you, Drew. Okay, I will get to my untap step, and then I will go to my upkeep step, <clears throat> and then I will do my draw step. Will you pay two for Smothering Tithe? I'm thinking about it. Are you gonna do it? Nope, cool. Are you? Yes. Are you? Oh, uh, maybe? Eat it. Get right yes. I thought we were going. Maybe tap your mana differently, because that's four swamps. <laughs> Don't worry. No, how's he going to play his Frick's Obliterator? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. Everything is fine. Actually, Nick. yeah, it's probably safe to play this. Mordevore. Cool. Uh, okay. Uh, Mordevore's power and toughness are equal to the number of creature cards in all graveyards. Oh. So, oh, so oh count them up, boys. You too. Oh, well, uh, okay. Cats. Yeah, all Sorry. graveyards. I don't think I have any creatures in my... Oh, that's God's count. One... Two, three, four, five. You had more. Six. You had more than anybody. Wow. Uh, mine's also five. So. Uh, two, so that's Thir what? Thirteen, plus, uh, 13 plus my three. Yeah, 16. 16. So 16. Oh boy, that's a beefy boy. More divorce is 16, 16. Yeah, go there you for go. it. <laughs> um, so you, gotta, you gotta hit somebody with a galvanic juggernaut, or else he attacks. Hmm. Uh, or I could just tap him and mill someone. Well, no, well, yeah, that's, that's what you're saying. That's what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. No. Or you could attack someone. You cast a spell, so Sun Scorch Regent gets a counter and I gain a life. Yeah, eat it. Um, do you guys remember no. if I played away in this turn? No, right? Because I just yeah, tapped the two mana lines. and then yeah. tapped the four for the Mordvor? Yeah, I don't I think, think you played correct. a land. I don't think you played a land. Excellent, because I have an eye land. Ooh. Um, just to keep Spell Pierce up. Um, <laughs> four Spike. 
You fool. Psych, it's, mental mis- it's mental misstep. <laughs> I've run mental misstep in the age before. I've countered someone's turn around so with no lands in play. Uh, Brendan, no five. Oh, I thought we were bros. I mean, we are. Two. But nobody's three, hitting you, four, and you and I are both five. hitting everybody, and I have to spread it around, and I don't want to hit that, so this is going to go up by one. True. Sure. Good call. Yeah, there's Lord Scorpion Goddess in there. Yay! I'm the worst one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get ya. Scorpion God was the black red one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. he's Rakdos. He gave okay. Ronus a shoulder massage. Is that it? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm done. Yeah, Go. Cool. Yeah, uh, untap. <laughs> Upkeep. Uh, at Farah trigger, I draw an additional card. Check. Um, Herald's Horn. <laughs> Not a god, I don't have to reveal it, but that'll mean I draw for turn. I thought Afara was each turn. Yeah. Beginning of your upkeep, right? Oh, control last turn? Last yeah. turn was Andy's turn. No, no, last turn is, is it my last turn? No, it just says At last turn. At the beginning turn. of each come oh. keep, if you had another creature enter the battlefield under your control last, last turn. turn. Last turn was uh, Andy's turn. And it didn't enter the battlefield under your control, you so it would be only your turn. Your control. What? Yeah. That's not how that works. You'd have to be playing with Flash all the time. Yeah. So that's why it's not particularly amazing in no. EDH. Yeah, it's each upkeep too, right? Yeah, it gave each upkeep. So if you do a creature on your turn, then you draw the card on my turn. That's how that would work. Oh. So, so, yeah. so this one well, back. no, no, because you would have ended up with that anyway, because you played a creature on your turn, so you would have drawn that card on my turn. Shit, okay. So so we're fine. Because you didn't have a creature okay. on Andy's turn, okay, but you cool. did on your turn. Okay, cool. As long as it wasn't like an instant that you really badly needed to play through last turn, I think I it's think, fine. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> um, I'm going to play this Hedron Archive. Trigger, mm-hmm. I gain a life and I get a counter on this. Sure, I'm going to crack it for two cards. Okay. You can do that just by tapping one land. Yeah. <sighs> Got a problem. But didn't you have to tap more than that to play it? Because you had to tap two lands to play it. Oh, yeah. Cheater. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm a cheater. He's a pumpkin eater for sure. Um, okay. So I just played uh, Hedron Archive and tapped it and cracked it for two cards. Mm. Right. Um, I'm gonna crack one of these treasures for a blue mm-hmm. and put this Kindred Summons on Morphon. Trigger. Yeah. And I'm going to also tap two and crack this last treasure for a Vanquisher's Banner. All my creatures get plus one, plus one, and whenever I cast a god, I draw a card. Oh, oh boy. Huh? Also, all your gods get plus one? Yeah, that's I think it's just the gods get one, one, right? Yep. Okay. Um, creatures I control the chosen type. I'll play a Shivan Reef as my land for a turn. Mm. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Mm. One, two, three, four, so five, six. Oh, FR is almost Creature. Close. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Phoenix is not also a creature. Um the tap morphon. Okay. He is a one, two, eight. Uh, I'm gonna mill Gabe for eight. So Morphon is an eight-eight. I'm gonna tap Morphon and mill. Gabe for eight. Yeah, I assume that was the case. Yep. Three, four, five, six, set, rip. Count any creatures for me, hey, bud? Yeah, for sure. Uh, you, you got my Whip of Erebos, my Swift Whip Boots. So, uh, two creatures, Soul's Attendant and Syndic of Tides. Sanguine Bond, another one of my win cons. Uh, yeah, but he's got both half of the bin. What yeah. if he's got but, a replenish? <laughs> it's uh, all over. Two, Syndic of Tides and Soul's Attendant. Count it. Yeah, excellent. Here go, Dan. Okay. I don't play a creature, so I don't get to draw a card. That's right. I'll draw my card. I pay two? Um, I think I will pay two. Yeah, we're gonna pay two. Okay. No um, more sending of tights for you. Oh. Then we're gonna do a good old nature's lore with the man looking up going, oh. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go get some sort of forest card that'll probably go in tapped because it'll be some kind of duel. Mm. And I'll uh, pass the turn. Okay. It's gonna be an overgrown tomb. Okay, fair enough. Uh, I'm gonna untap, upkeep, I'm gonna gain two and then lose one because of Phyrexian Arena. Um, Brendan, you will be getting one treasure because I'm only gonna pay for you to not get one. Sweet. Oh, I should have gotten a moment counter for my nature's lore. Yes, thank you. Almost forgot about that. Okay, so yeah. 
And then draw another card. Okay, here we go. Um, quite a few things I can do, but... <sighs> I'm trying to think of what's the biggest threat to me right now. I mean, Probably. Brendan's got a Marori's but, Wake in play and a Smothering Tide in this Herald's <laughs> The Mortivore is also good. Mortivore's... Like yeah, the Mortimer will just kill us, somebody. Soon. Well, yeah, it's gonna start milling things for like yeah, I nineteen each turn. I don't expect it to yeah. be around for long. Yeah, I mean, single card probably Mortivore. Single player probably Brendan. <laughs> okay, well, Brendan's also milled you for more than I have at this point. You? I cut you for seventeen. I mean, you haven't gotten used to Mortimer you get, yet. You get him for twenty next turn. Yeah. Okay. Well, it depends more, on how many creatures yeah. he kills. Yeah. Okay. Um. Because he goes to the Juggernaut first. Well, I don't know how much, at least how much that will happen, but um, I guess for now I'm going to tap four so I can recast Karlov. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And nothing else I really need to play at the moment, so um, Drew, I'll pass the turn off to you. Okie dokie. Uh, I'm going to do my unteep step, and then I'm doing my upkeep step, and my draw step. You pay two? Um, I'm thinking about it. Yeah, I'm going to pay two. Um, Hmm. Bummer. I mean, I'm in a spot because. Spot or bother? You can't milk people for 19, though. Yeah. Honestly, I may need to mill myself just to grease some wheels, like Dan was talking about earlier. Okay. <laughs> Milling yourself for five seems okay. It does seem okay. Milling yourself for 20 seems excessive, but it does five seem seems excessive. okay. Um, I'm already halfway through my deck at this point. <laughs> but I think we're going to take five. Okay. So we're milling Wall of Junk, Island, River of Tears, Drift of Phantasms, and Intruder Alarm. Well, that was we got all the Intruder Alarm. It was all good except the last one. Yeah, that was a bad idea. Well, uh, I mean, how many creatures went into your bin? Uh, da, 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 Two, da, three? Da, I think it was three. Wapa, Remember Drift of Drift Phantasms, Phantasms and, Wall of and Wall of Junk. So yeah, two. two. So, so two. So Twenty one. Twenty wink. There you go. All right. Um, we're gonna try to recover this turn with a Glacial Wall. Uh, trigger, Ooh. plus one counter, gain a life, two counters on Karlov. Please stop. Well, I gotta remind myself more than anything. Ooh. It's got a it's so got a Please stop, you're hurting me. Oh. Um, Kicking him under the table. Stop. <laughs> Don't. Stop it. Don't. That's the turn. Cool. Okay. On your end step. Uh, I'm gonna mill game for six. Eight? Nine, I mean? Yes. Nine, Nine. I mean. That's a number. Dude. Angrily counting in French. Yeah. Angrily counts in French. That's the only subtitle we're going to have on this episode. Angrily counts in French. <laughs> I think we're not going to subtitle the opening. No. And we should just subtitle uh, some of the English as well. Yeah. You got, wow, you got almost exclusively lands except for two creatures. Ooh. You got uh, seven lands, yuck. a Felidor Sovereign, and a Tithe Drinker, so that goes up by two. Uh, yeah, Call yeah, of the Kindred Trigger. Okay. One, two, ooh, Thass is good. Three, Karanus is better. Or I mean, creatures. Five. Well, I get to get one of them. Oh, right. From no, Call of the Kindred. Uh, at the beginning of your upkeep, I may look at the top five cards in my library. If I do, I may put a creature card that shares a creature type with enchanted creature from among them into the battlefield. Yeah. So I'm going to put Karanos into play. Do the others go on the bottom of your library or yes. graveyard? Yeah, those um, go on the bottom. Okay. I did a blue green elf deck once for that card. It's a, it's a good one. It's uh, one of my faves. I'm going to Herald's Horn. Look at it. Nope. I don't have to reveal it. It's not a god. Okay. Let's see if Karanos is a creature. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He is a creature. Damn. And Afar is a creature. Okay. Slight spook? Yeah. Slight spook. I... Um... I kept him. Ooh. Yeah. And I also have to reveal the first card I drew on each of my turns. Oh, yeah. Which it's not a land card. It is not. You get to bolt. So I get to bolt something for three. Okay. Good luck. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> looks at Drew's board, looks away from Drew's board. Uh, carrying feeder. Uh, response? Yeah. Uh, throw it in the pit. Sure. Hey, creature died. I untacked Gal Galvanic Jogger. Yeah, and I get a Sapperling. Hmm. <laughs> what do we do? What do we do? I don't know. One, two, I honestly didn't three, think I was getting four, this far five. with this deck. I sort of, sort of brought this in last minute. 
I mean, I've seen that deck go off pretty na in a pretty nasty means. Well, I've two carded you a couple times, but that's th there's a couple of the poker hands in here. Yeah. Well, uh, you get like that with fraying sanity. That alone is just. It will kill it's a not man. Bad. Yep. It will kill the man. How you could just kill a man? Have well, you ever thought about killing a man? Yeah, I take all of the cards out of his deck and then he leaves in anger. <laughs> I'm sorry, your husband was decarded. <laughs> your, your husband was <laughs> milled out. <laughs> was it um, painful? Yes, it was very embarrassing for him. <laughs> Everything except for your husband himself was in his graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tap. Two to play this prismatic lens. Maybe I'm sorry, your husband's uh, been exiled. Trigger for uh, Sun Scorch Regent, uh, and then two counters on Karlov. I'll also tap three for this Worn Power Stone. Yet again, it happens. <coughs> I need card draw. Four, five, six. You need draw uh, cards. Do okay. You, you don't have enough card advantage? No, I need more. What do you, do you have pretty severe card advantage at the moment. Yeah, but what do I do with it all? You play more cards. Mill Gabe? Yes! <laughs> Preferably stop milling me! <laughs> no, mill more! Uh, okay. I'm sorry, ma'am, your husband's been exiled. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna mill Gabe for... Oh, I didn't think he'd do it. <laughs> I'm gonna pass a turn. I can mill Gabe whenever I want. <laughs> Untap. Draw. Are we Ooh, paying pink? two? Um, He's, he can decide. Let me think about it. He can choose. God, Give me a second. Oh! Um, Stop rushing me. I was laughing at our earlier game when I was editing it before. Mm -hmm. The Hound. I hope so. Oh, All yeah. right, Hound Tribal. Yeah, you better watch it, dude. You were like, is that a, you were like explaining that it was your Hound. You were like, yes, we know. I forget. I don't know. I will not pay two. You can have your treasure. Really? Cool. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. I need to get like a treasure a stack of little like golden coins. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think I actually have treasure tokens with me if you want. Really? Them. Yeah. Well, is uh, it the uh, cool Orzhov treasure tokens? I want like, like a no one. No, it's the foil F and M ones. You have a foil oh, one? Even better. Yeah, I have several. I would actually want. That. I went on a streak of winning F and M's. It went well. Cool. What, and all you got were filthy treasure tokens. <laughs> I, 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 right when I started winning, they switched it to tokens from promos, and right when I stopped, they switched it back. But <laughs> I'll, I'll play a reflecting pool. Um, we are going to play. A pawn of Ulamaj. Nice. Trigger, mm -hmm. yep. I get a counter and some life, etc. So whenever it or another non-token creature I control dies, uh, I get a 0-1 Eldrazi span. Okay. Then we're going to play a Merciless Executioner. Oh, okay. So first get your trigger. Yeah, uh, another one on this, another life. I'm at 54 life, by the way. Just uh, throwing that out there. Just throw that trigger out there. off <laughs> Merciless Executioner. Uh, when it comes in, each player sacrifices a creature. Yeah. Um, I'll sacrifice my next least ram. How do I stack Galvanic Juggernaut triggers right now? Oh, yeah. uh, Am I about to mill 20? No. We you can... are. Okay. Yep. Okay. Oh, with 25 if you tap it now in response to the first. Yeah, right. Okay. Brendan. What? Mill 20. Uh, mill 5. Okay. There's gonna be a few more One, of these. Two. Three. Four. Creature. Five. Creature. Two creatures. All right, uh, now everyone sacrifices a creature. Okay. Yeah. Next place, wall. Next yeah. place for him. Ilharg. Great. Okay. Are you doing the replacement effect for Ilharg? Or, uh, oh, yeah, I put him three from the top. Is, is it a replacement effect, or is it a when or an if? He dies, put it into when. exile okay, okay. for the battlefield. You may put it into its owner's library okay. third from the top. S since it's a when, you still get the Juggernaut trigger. Okay. So uh, right now, um, my triggers go on the stack first, because I'm the active player. Yes. So I have a, a make Eldrazi spawn trigger right now. Um, and then you have four Galvanic Juggernaut triggers on top of that. Ooh, actually, before Ilharg dies, I'm gonna tap him and mill Gabe for six. Or for nine. For nine. Yeah, yeah. Or sorry, Drew. Drew for nine. Drew? Yeah, oh, Drew for nine. Thank you. Because you, you milled me for five, so I thought I should okay. do a favor. More than half my deck. For nine? Nine. nine. <clears throat> this is what I was hoping for on the first one. What is it? Um, we got Test Subject, Flood of Tears, Cyclonic Rift, Notion Thief, Thran Dynamo, Convince and Concoct, Mind Grind, um, Island, and Drakestown Forgotten. So three more creatures there. Oh my God, I'm really scared about that card. Don't worry about it. It's not another Mortivore, even a little bit. All right, so your four Galvanic Juggernaut triggers are currently on the stack. Understood. Um, 10 and 10. Great. Sure. Uh, my two triggers will resolve, the Pong Gulamog <sighs> and the Golgari Germination. Two. Three. That thing is going to become a problem later. So. No. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's a problem now. 
Um, Count up creatures. Oh yeah. Oh Sorry. yeah. We, we we should definitely do one, a recount. Two, uh, one three, creature. Four. Okay. Five. Um, okay. And. Um, <clears throat> so I got five more. From mine. You added five I, more? Yeah, from that, from the ten. Drew, I need you to not mill me right now because I think I will lose. <laughs> You could mill him and then I I'll, mean, I'll I mean, I have him this Mortivore. Don't do it! But and it's him. Dan's turn. Uh, I will go to my end step. Okay, I have a, I have a decision to make here. I also <laughs> have a decision I need to potentially I make. I feel like we should recount how many creatures are in the bin. Just because I feel like it'd be easy to lose track. Okay, I will do that. Yeah. yeah. I, I currently have four. One, two. Nine. Okay, so together we're 13. Okay. 14. So 27. Uh, 11. Uh, 38. Okay, it was four higher than we yeah. thought. Wow, you were right. Um, okay, I don't think I'm gonna do anything right now, Drew. You can go ahead. Okay. Um, it's my end step. Oh. It's, it's Dan's end yeah, step. Yeah, sorry, yeah, do you yeah, have yeah. something first? Oh, well, no, 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 it's just... Um, no, so it me first, I'm gonna pass it to Drew. Shit. <laughs> I mean, how many cards left in his deck is public well, knowledge? Well, the thing is, is Mortifor dies if Gabe goes to his turn. He can kill Mortifor right now. Yeah, he's gonna kill it with Karlov. <clears throat> so when he goes to kill it with Karlov, I have to be able to... Wait, is it a destroy or is it... Exile. Remo it's exile target creature. So regenerate's not gonna save me today. No. Um, how do I do this where I actually end up... I guess I kill Gabe right now, huh? Don't do it. I mean, you'll end up with your Mortivore Lexile, but Gabe probably dead. I haven't counted, but it looks like less than 38 cards. Yeah, I think I have to. You really gonna do it? Well... I mean, if it's not exactly 38, we have the means of production. I mean, I can also get you, probably. Yeah, but don't. <laughs> you cannot get me. I mean, you, you, you can, can make me You can start getting Dan. We can, I can get we, half of your deck. If we I combine, have 38. Drew, if we combine all of our cards, I think we could probably do it, actually. You I have probably half of it on my board. And I have, I have the other half, most likely, because these are all getting plus three, plus three. Yeah. I mean, you could. Should we do it? How many creatures do you think are in Dan's deck? Let's do it. That'd be great. I'll give you an... Uh, there's probably a lot of creatures in my deck. I'll be real with you. Most of my deck's creatures are enchantments. You gotta bring everything down. Because if you don't do it now, you're not gonna do it later. Because that thing's going away soon. I know. Well, it's going away on Gabe's turn. Yep. Right? As soon as I pass priority here, this thing is dead. Yeah. Uh, uh, I, I will confirm that. Just yeah, no. Being honest. I, guy, we're playing good, honest magic here uh, with mill strategy. What do we got? <laughs> what are you buying? What are you selling? What are you selling? I guess I'm hitting Dan <sighs> for 38. All right. All right. Uh, yeah, I am going oh, to exile Oh, I'm going to regret spots. that. All right, so he's exiling in response. I am definitely milling 38. Yeah. And no more. I'm sorry. One. I should have killed you. I should have killed you. There was four, no other thing I should have done. I should have killed you. Seven. I softened up, and I'm going to pay for it. That's fine. 10, 11, 12, I'll kill him for you. 13. Hey, if you can get him before I'm, his I probably can. I got, I got priority now. Yeah. So if, if we can live the dream where we both, oh. where you get to get rid of my Mortivore and get Gabe dead. This is the dream right now I'm living. Oh, Brendan, did you draw a card on uh, Dan's upkeep from uh, Thatcher? No, I missed the trigger. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. 36, 37, 38. We're playing hard. We're Oof. playing hardcore stoner rules okay. where if you miss a trigger, it's just kind of like, yeah, I got to admit that. <laughs> yeah, it's on me, guys. Priority um, passes to me. Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, what am I not doing? <laughs> <laughs> a better question. Nine. Oh, this is a weird game, boys. Eight. Uh, I'm getting ready. And eight. So... 25? 25. Yeah. I think you, I think you got it. Do you have devotion for a fat Yeah. Two, three, five. Are you sure? There's one card left. Oh, fuck, yeah, <laughs> I do. One, two, three, four, one sec. five, six. Oh, yeah, seven. okay, yeah, I, I, okay. I missed these Rude. two guys. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I've got one card left in deck, so this is my last no. turn. No! <sighs> so close, Brendan. I know, but so far. We almost got to have, key, have cake and eat it. So I shouldn't have wasted those counters back. then if I was going to live this turn. Uh, okay. Yeah, really. Oh wait, no! I, I die because Phyrexian Arena draws me another card. Yay! <laughs>
Oh, are you gonna pay the two so he doesn't get this mothering tithe? No, do it. Of course I am. What? Yeah. Okay, so. Oh, dildo. I'll, 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 be, I'll be fair about this. Uh, also, before I go, I'm going to mess up the board a little bit because Ooh, I, like I can. It, I like it, I like it. Uh, okay, so I'm like 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 upkeep. Like uh, I only have one permanent in play. <laughs> no two. Well, Sorry. remember, I've got, still got stuff in my hand that I can play. Okay, so. Uh, first like thing it, is like Ajani's mantra trigger, okay. gain a life, two counters on Carl. Um, I guess I'll tap the, yeah. Tapping the Orajar Basilica and removing these six counters from Carl in response to that so I can exile a creature. Go um, do it. Do it. Brendan, which do ones it. yours are creatures right now? These four. Those ones? Okay, sure. Is Karen a creature without, what's his yes. face? Yes. Yeah. Oh, without the Borgo? No, no he's yeah. not. So there's three. Yep. No, neither is Phoenix isn't a creature either. You should get rid of the Gog Vanek, and you're not. Uh, no, you could also not, because it's, it's the only hope to beat Brendan at this moment. I'm not sure if you can call either of our boards a spook. No. Um, I have two mine permanents. Is no spook. You guys got Mordor. Uh, I'm going to exile your commander, Brendan. Oh. I cry. Uh, <laughs> okay. I'm going to no. I guess I should. Okay, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the one from Phyrexian Arena and draw the card. Okay, it was a swamp, so it doesn't really matter. But I have one more card I can play before I die. Um, oh, what do y'all no think? One, what do you? Two. What do you guys think is the scariest oh, thing wait. on the board right now? Did six. A fire is no longer a creature. Does that count as a creature dying, Dan? What? No, it's exiled. Oh, wait, that's right. That, or, or no, it goes to the command zone as a replacement effect. Okay. Um, so no. Yeah, I'm paying two so Brendan doesn't get a t doesn't get a treasure token. Wow, uh, spite! Yeah. Oh, I'm dying! Us. I am literally going to lose. Uh, <laughs> no okay. reason not Next to. Next arena trigger on the stack. Um, is it gonna do pull egg? I've got one more thing. <laughs> I've got one more thing that I can get rid of. I Start need you guys. Dead body no. Actually, sorry, the first arena trigger's already happened. Yeah, but uh, before my still, draw, still in your upkeep. Yeah. Yeah, before my draw, I have one more card I can play. Mm. Uh, what should I get? What do you guys think I should get rid of? Going from Dan's board. Uh, I don't know. Your Marauders Wakes gonna end up being a problem. That might end up being a problem, especially with Dan's deck. It's yeah, the true. Waker. Actually, actually, you're right. That is good. That does stop me from winning almost entirely. <laughs> so I think I will bring it back next turn. Well, well I mean, even still. Well, I mean, back you say that. Here. Yes, I do. Yes. How? Well, if, if he doesn't bring that back, uh, he's gonna bring back the motor. With all of the things Brendan just put in my graveyard. Okay. Well. Uh, I guess we're, I guess that's probably going to be the big problem here because we'll get rid of Dan. So um, I'm going to utter, utter end it. It's exiled. Oof. Oh, it's exiled. Yep. That, that's uh, what I meant. Things slightly. Uh, okay, and then I draw, and stuff. I've got no library, so uh, I'm the first to go in this game. That's Aha! super unfortunate. It's unfortunate because uh, you take your deck with you, and I needed your graveyard. Uh, One step closer also, to victory. I was going to play Necropotence, and then I realized, wait a minute, I'm putting everything in the graveyard anyway. This is a bad time to Necropotence. <laughs> <laughs> so my board has been thoroughly cleared. I would, um, I'm down to one idiot. This is fine. He's not even a creature. No, he's not. I'm uh, pretty effed here. He's fine. I didn't even get to swing with Karlov. I swung with him once and he immediately got killed by your generous gift. He's scary. <laughs> I uh, was probably going to win on turn You attacked six. for 11 flying life. Oh, like. oh, I saw that. It's actually not going to be as good as you think. I did not see that. Uh, it's a torrential gear hole. <laughs> Ooh! Are you playing it just like not with flash? Just no, I don't. don't well, he's still playing it with flash, just on his main face. I literally have no yeah, other yeah, there's, there's a, things to do at yeah, the yeah. moment, okay. right? Might as well get another big beefy boy so you can keep right, milling no, people. You can get some instant. instant. Sorcery. No, yeah. just an instant. Just an instant. Ooh. Well, the main thing is getting a, is getting another big beefy boy um, on the field. Yeah, that's true too. None of my creatures can attack or block. I know, and like. Some of mine can, but not very well. <laughs> you, you got like Eldrazi's bonds, those are fine. They attack for zero. Oh, hey, did you pay two? No. Nope. You know, send a message. Did you pay two? That's the important part of that. He did. He did. Fucking asshole. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Turn two in modern, swing with Birds of Paradise. It's about sending a message. You gotta know. Turn one, swing with Birds of Paradise. That's the real play. Oh. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, I have two options here. Mm -hmm. um, fuck you, or remake the Mortivore by getting Concoct out of here. Um, I mean, Concoct's a good one. Is Concoct you... an instant? Oh, it's a sorcery. It, uh, no, it has to be an instant. Yeah. I think it is. I, I, I don't know. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's find uh, it bum, in bum, here. Bum, it bum, was bum, in bum, here. Bum. Yeah, 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 I saw you melt. No, it's a sorcery. Okay. That's unfortunate. I always do that. Um, so it's just fuck you? 
So just fuck you, yeah, I guess. Well, actually, it isn't even going to do that. Yeah, it's oh. just it's it's going to be a medium. It's going to yep. be kind of like. I yeah. actually have no targets for this spell. Uh, don't you have a cyclonic rift in there? That is it. Yep. So you can bounce one thing. Yep. Nice. I mean, that's still going to be okay. No. Yeah. Oh, uh, Torrential Good Health just like lets you play, and just play, play the instant from your graveyard rather than yeah, like, put it in your hand. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I mean, you can bounce a Mirari's Wake. That's could, yeah. That's the only you, play. You can bounce a Treasure Token. You could bounce a Treasure. I mean, if you wanted to. Okay. Fine. If you felt so inclined. Yeah, that's the play. Michael. Yep. Okay. Untap. Uh, Sometimes you just need a five six. Up I honestly, key. I just needed a physical body. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, it <laughs> is a god, so it goes into my hand. It's Hazareth the Fervorant. Mm. One, one of the favorites for my Rakdos deck. Yeah, it's a good card. It's all right, I've heard. Mm. 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 Uh, I'm gonna crack yeah. all three of these treasures. Nope. And this temple. Mm -mm. Play Marari's Wake. Don't like it. Naturally. Yes. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. That seems right. A more fun. Mm. Uh, cast trigger, Vanquisher's Banner, draw a card. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna play this Temple of Abandon as my land for turn. I'm gonna scry. Yeah, that's gonna go on the bottom. And then I will cast Hazaret, draw a card. And I will cast Erebos. Draw a card. Yep. Do you have black mana up for? Oh no, the black is reduced. That's right. Yeah. Never mind. So they cost generic. Mm -hmm. Especially uh, with Mirari's Wake. That's real good. Yeah. yeah. Let's see what's a creature. I'll be honest, Dan. I have zero plays. A very few. Okay. I'm gonna be honest with you, Drew. I have literal zero. I played the wrong spell. The other one said sorcery, and this one didn't. One, oh. two, three. So there's a different one card. So I could have gone and gotten my board clear. Yep. One, two, three. Well, it'll board clear will be even better now. Yeah, but I have to wait another turn to play it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, my first card I drew this turn was, was also supposed to do this. So what you, you should have done is just I should let have me done live something and I could have potentially merciless eviction. It's fine, I missed the trigger. Um, but you threatened my board state, and then you were going to clear my board, Phoenix is and I was going to get nothing. Well, I was going to exile all enchantments at some point. Yeah. Um. She's a fire creature, though. One, two, three, four, five. No, she's not. I'm missing how Phoenix is a creature. I'm only getting to six. Uh, if you one, left two, one, two or alive, three, four, four five, 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 on the six. next turn. Yep. Okay. Yep. Well, if the more. Yeah, but like. <coughs> seven. I didn't want you to win that easily. Eight. <laughs> Because you get rid of Brendan, yeah, and then you would pretty much get rid of Dan like the next turn right after. I would, tr uh, yeah. That would be my only play. Like that and the Galvanic Juggernaut is it. I, see, see, like, that's I why have I'm, no card draw for the rest of this. That's kind of why like, on my way out, I had to get rid of whatever I could just to make the rest of this game feel a little bit more fair. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> what do I do? Mm. Who do I mill? Do I mill Drew? <clears throat> Sorry, I was yeah. coughing. I said, yeah. mil I said, I said Mill Andy. Yeah. Uh, I mean, or kill Dan. Well, Dan's not super threatening. He's not. He's not really threatening right now. What is he doing? Well, he's eventually. He's he, he has three viable sack engines and a couple guys who make dudes when he sacks things. Actually, I only have two viable sack engines, and neither of these cares. And neither of these deals with tokens. You do have pawn. My, my deck is really low, and I feel like if you get one good discard combo off, I'm out. On the plus side so I'm gonna okay. pass <laughs> the turn. All right. Yeah. I'll I should have I should have been doing milling on my I'll, on your end stuff, but I didn't. Yeah. So I'll be a hundred percent with you. Um, I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> we want to see. Uh, no, with that attitude, I'll draw my card. Um, both of my board clears are in exile. I Hard. will pay two. Oh, draw a card. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm paying two right now. Oh, oh, you, you, you got a card, that's what I yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, I will pay two. Yep. Yep, I'm, I'm, I'm paying two. Uh, I'll play a Care Keep as my land, mm -hmm. which can make cobbles. That's how you pronounce it? I sure. It was, I thought it was cobbles. No, I, I've always heard it as cobbles. Yes. Okay. Um, it's, a, it's a strange dialect. It is. Uh, we're going to play an Outpost Siege. 
I will name dragons. Ooh. Whenever a creature I control leaves the battlefield, deals one damage to a creature or player. Ooh, that's good. We'll crack the Eldrazi spawn with a trigger on the stack here and Ooh. play a Blood Artist. Ooh. Uh, and uh, response. Uh, to Blood Artist? Yeah, should we start doing the mill now? I, I can't, I have nothing to tap. Really? My board got clicked. Mm. I got hosed out. Alright, keep going. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna ping you for one, Brennan. Yeah. Um, and then that's, that's it and all, pass turn. Alright. Draw a card, you paint two. Yep. Oh. Land. I just, I have literally nothing else to do with my mana. <laughs> really? I think the Morphon Pool actually goes untapped because you only have three, two what opponents. What is that? <clears throat> I have two opponents, yeah. Oh, is it just more than one? Two or more. Oh, two oh or more. Oh my god. Yeah, no. Oh, I thought you had to have four. Okay. okay no, yeah, as, as long as I got two, you My bad, my bad. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Some people play three player EDH games, like. Like us. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was going to say like monsters, but. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm playing this scab. Cool. Scab. And I'm going to go get that. Yep. What is it? Uh, it is this Flood of Tears. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, bounces non land permanence. And then he gets to put something in for free if he bounces enough of his own. I will not. <laughs> Probably not. I remember, I remember when I do not have enough non-land permanence. I remember Go. when uh, M20 was like On your end step? release. I'm gonna mill Dan for 24. Ooh. Ooh. Um, Gnarly. I can chip in six. So let's do see it. how far yeah. you get. Do it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Remember when M twenty had just came out and flooded tears were printed, and people were doing combos with it with omniscience? Yeah. Uh, oh my god. Nothing graveyard relevant, I don't think. You did get the nope. Yogmoth. You got a doubling season, a Deathbringer Thoctor, and a Garrick Wildspeaker. So. Cool. So if you hit him for six, I can kill him. Yeah. So I can. I'm gonna chip in. Six I have thirteen cards. Yoke. One, two, three, four, five, six. Untap. Uh, upkeep. Reveal if it's a god. Oh, it is a god. Karametro. Okay. It is god of the Harvest, even. And then I draw my first card for turn. Yep. What is it? Uh, Caves Kyrenos. of Coilos. So, so you what draw do I an do? extra card. I draw an extra card. Ooh. Just a couple cards. No, wait, wait. What did the first card you drew during your turn be that god? Or no, was that, a re- that was it, Reveal. Yeah, oh. yeah, and it puts it into Yeah, Reveal, hand, yeah. and then I put it into my hand. I don't okay. Draw. My bad. Uh, but if um, I play Caves of Coilos. It just goes into his hand. He doesn't draw it. <clears throat> hmm. You need a pencil to draw it. Okay, okay I get it. I, every time that I've been playing modern recently, I've Damn. had to make at least one judge call. I'm not the best. I'm sorry. I expect the best of you. The best. Because you're the best. Around. <laughs> okay, stop it. Stop it. This is kind of spicy. I think I'm going to do it. Too I don't much. like that. One, two, spicy. three. Talking to you because I'm worried about my health. I think I'm gonna die. Well, I'm very concerned. I for <sighs> can't do those jokes around me, Dan. Paying myself for one to add two black. Okay. Uh, five six. Extinguish all hope. Destroy all non-enchantment creatures. Oh. I have several responses. <laughs> 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 all right. First of all, it's the mat I'm playing with. Look, it's the mat oh, I'm playing is. with. Oh, it is. <laughs> <laughs> um, you have been waiting so long oh, to do that, haven't you? Yes, it's amazing. I'm pretty okay. sure that that's the reason why you built the gods deck. So oh, yeah. first, we're going to sacrifice uh, the Sapperlang to the pit. Yes. Trigger. Uh, trigger off Blood Artist, then Outpost Siege. We'll get you for two, and I'll gain a life. Okay. Go down to also hit three because it's each opponent for Blood uh, Artist. It is right? not each opponent; it's oh, target. It's target. Oh, they're, sure. they're both targets. Oh, this okay. can get creatures though too. That's cool. Um, then we are going to sack a uh, Corpse Jack Menace. To um, bombardment or spawning pit. Get another trigger on that. Um, and I'm uh, you're gonna take two, and I'm gonna gain one. And then okay. I'm also gonna get a uh, Eldrazi spawn and another Sapperling. All right. Um, then we are going to sacrifice um, this Sapperling. This is gonna go for a while. Brenda. To the spawning pit. This is fine. It's gonna be a long game. Uh, take two. I'll gain a life. Brandon. I don't think so. Yeah, it's already been an hour. It's been lo- it's already been longer than all of our other episodes. Wow. Um, if you edited those down, right? Right. Then <laughs> I'll <laughs> I'll sacrifice uh, this Eldrazi spawn to make a mana. You'll take two. I'll gain one. Okay. What color mana? Down to uh, it's colorless. Twenty seven. Oh, okay. I'll use the colorless to make a two two spawn token, which I do not think I brought with me, which is a shame because oh, I did. There it is. Um, <laughs> oh, it's spawn. I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
then I'm going to. Um, You're going to sacrifice spawn? E, uh, in, um, yes. Yes, I am. going to sacrifice spawn to the Goblin Bombardment. I'll deal you three. Okay. Are we not sacking everything at this one. point? I am, but I have to do it in the right order. Well, yes, that's. that's 24. Uh, oh, I understand it. Sack the. Sapperling. Hang on. Okay. Take your time. So what I'm trying to leverage is getting the mana off of this guy to get extra guys up the spawning pit. Because each extra guy gets two extra damage as opposed to the one extra that I would yeah. get off of that. So it's one extra damage each time if I can get a spawning pit off it. Um, so I will s sacrifice... Um, no. Yeah, I sacrifice... Okay, I sacrifice the Sapperling. Do you call him Bombardment? Deal you three. Okay. Then 41. I sacrifice... Oh yeah, I'm sorry, thank you. I'm up to 41. Uh, then I sacrifice... Uh, Pawn of Ulamog to the spawning pit. Yep. Uh, you'll take two, I'll gain one, and I'll get an Eldrazi. 19. Oh, I made a mistake. That's fine, though. Um... Because now uh, I sacrifice the Aldrazi spawn to make another spawn token. Um, you'll take two and I'll gain one. 17. 43. Um, then I'll sacrifice the spawn token to a uh, Goblin Bombardment. Take three, I'll gain one. 14. 44. I'll sacrifice Blood Artist to the Goblin Bombardment. Take three, I'll gain one and 11. I'll get a Sapperling. Um, and then I'll sacrifice the Sapperling to Goblin Bombardment, take two. Okay. Uh, nine. Great. That was so a close. lot of damage, though. Yeah. You got so close, Dan. I could have gotten one more damage. That's right, though. Hmm. Uh, all right, anyway, extinguish all hope. Any responses, Andy? I'm down. All right. Blows up all the non enchantments, Ooh. which is more fun, I believe. Uh, is yeah. Phoenix a creature? Uh, no. Two, four, six. Yeah. He's also in four enchant. guys. I'm going to milli out for eight. Exaxes. What do you announce? Wait. So you lose on your up, you'll draw a step. Unfortunate. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. 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 Unless you can put cards back in your Maybe. library. Maybe. Maybe. Nope. <laughs> Not at all. Not even close, friend. Close, motherfucker. Oh. Um, Orphan's one's gone. But this is fine. Um. You're the best. All right. One, two. I gotta find my way to pull. Find way to pull myself out of this. Karametra, uh, draw card. Mm. Yep. Um. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. Damn it! So close yet so far. Yeah. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Afara is a creature. Yes. So you can mill more? Yeesh. Or we could just attack. Or we could just attack. Right. Yeah. I mean, I'm uh, wide open here. Um, Good point. We'd also make you mill and then see how you like it. Mm. Probably fine. Grave digging might get me out of this. Mm. I have a Texas Hold'em hand here, Dave. Temple of <laughs> Plenty is my line for turn. I would like to see. It's uh, not good. Right. The bottom? Correct. Um, one of them he knows I have because I fished it. One, two, three, Descendants Path. Uh, at the beginning of my upkeep, I can reveal the top card of my library. If it's a creature that shows a creature type with a creature that I control, I can cast it without paying its mana cost. Karametra's a creature. Yep. Um, <coughs> excuse me. I'm worried. You should be. <laughs> I'm in danger. Well, you're. <laughs> You're dead. You're like a man walking around carrying his kidney. <laughs> It'll be fine. He just he knows he's not gonna make it. He's just wondering when it's gonna happen. It'll be fine. Uh, this is very graphic. <laughs> is this something you've witnessed? I need Go to, to combat. Know. Both kidneys. <laughs> Six, seven, both eight. Kidneys. Six plus seven is. Uh, did a creature die 13. this turn? Come on to attack? Yep, Morphon died. Oh, yeah, and all my creatures died. That's yeah. right. <laughs> <laughs> um, and you have the few cards in hand, too. So that's five. 13. No, I have two cards in hand. Yeah, oh, yeah exactly, exactly. Yeah. So six plus seven, 13. Attackers. Plus 
Yeah. No, one or fewer. So how's our calculation? Oh, I thought it was two or fewer. No. Okay. okay. So it's eight and six, which is fourteen. Fourteen. Are you going to me? No, you're dead. Okay. That's, that's <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? I'm, I'm just swinging say, at Drew play. for fourteen. Uh, swing at me? Yeah, fourteen. Oh, yeah. No, that hits me square in the jaw. Twenty-six. Okay. Uh, you go down. On square my upkeep for twenty-six. Several things. Uh, first, we're going to activate Care Keep, making a Cobalt token, which I don't think I have with me, but I was wrong about the other one, so maybe I actually have it. Um, you just collected such an amazing collection of tokens. I had to draw years. some of them. Some of them do not exist. Oh. Uh, instead of a Cobalt, it'll be the Psychic Energy. Ooh. That's a Cobalt now. Nice. Um, then I'm going to throw that uh, Cobalt into the pit. I take one. Yep. Great. I will activate the pit. Make making a spawn. a spawn token. Make it spawn. And I'll sacrifice it to take three. Okay. Go to five. Uh, I will go to my draw step. Yes. No cards. Yay! Yay. <laughs> it's okay, Drew. He's only at five life. Yeah, you can, can do you, this. Can you hit me for five? No! <laughs> <laughs> can you attack me with for five? I literally lost one attack in this ah, deck. Ah, take your turn. Let me win. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna go to my unturn, and then my rotate, and then my flip. Hey, are you paying two? Uh... I don't think you should. No, I'm not gonna. Sweet. You dingle. You dingle dang. That's what I think about you. She called you a dingle dang. What I like Probably one of the best games you. I've had with this deck ever. Dingle dang. So we got it on well. camera. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You're excited about that, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> I am God's tribal now. We're tapping six mana. I and we are sorcerying this flood of tears. Yep. Oh. Uh, return all non land permanents to their owner's hand. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> clean up, clean up. Everybody has your hands. Clean up, clean up. Oh, Put stuff back in my hand. Okay. I'm actually, Ryan, right. that's impressive. I rhyme well, hand with hand. Yeah, and it's a perfect rhyme. <laughs> Professional musician, Andrew Preacher. It rhyme, that's as close a rhyme as you can get. It's exactly the I same. I can rhyme hand with hand. Um, next go. Uh, can you count the cards in your deck, Brendan? Sure. Because I'm playing the Shell One, Dark. 1, 2, Isle. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, Damn. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 20, okay, well, this ain't gonna work. You were hoping to traumatize, weren't you? No, um, because this thing, uh, I can hide a card under it and I can flip that card up uh, if there is a deck with 20 or fewer cards in it. Ah, okay. However, Dan just died. I did just died. <laughs> I'm looking for outs here. <laughs> is what's happening. I want to see what it is. What's your life total? I want to peek. It was, it was 26. I see. It was a bad. Well, it's a card. <laughs> um, Actually, that seems pretty good in this situation. It's doable, right? Yeah. It could it could maybe get me there. Um, we're going to search for Scanta. Okay. Ooh. So if we get another turn, we may draw into an answer. That's pretty good, yeah. Michael? Yeah. Hey, that's a pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Makes it up. A peek draw. Hmm. Come on, Drew, he's at five. I believe in you. I don't. Oh man, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I, I got my board hosed, and then I'm like, well, I'm gonna pull this board clear out of my graveyard, hope I get to play it. And then I did, and then everybody else was dead already, and then I'm like, oh. I mean, it's still pretty good. Nanny. Because he's gonna try Mirari's Wake and then something else. Right. You're gonna straight up play more fun, and that's it. <laughs> wow, bold move. I did it! I mean, wait, Morphon's not in the command zone, though, is he? Yeah. Oh, because yeah. he died. Because he died, died. Right, dude, yeah. yeah. It's right. Totally remember that. I remember. Yeah. My memory is like... Sharp. My memory is like... Existent. Sand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What was, what was the great... Oh, yeah. I remember when this was all underwater. <laughs> <laughs> I was an Atlantean, like your grandfather. <laughs> Alright. Uh, how are you putting me out of my misery, Brendan? I'm not. Mario's Wake? Well, I can't do anything. It really cost so oh, much. Wait, no, I was it? Yeah, can't do anything. No, no, I got you. I just... 26. Yeah. You got lots of mana now, though. I've taken yeah. one chunk in the mouth for 14. Mm. See, Brendan would have lost if he hadn't gotten rid of my car love. <laughs> Brendan would have lost if you didn't get rid of my Mortimer with your Karlov. 
Nah. Mm. So we, were answer, at, we were at what is called an impasse. So the answer to everything was get rid of Karlov. All right. I mean, that is how we played the first few turns of this game, yes. That's fair. I also didn't have my swift foot booties. Taking 10 commander damage on turn four is like, not okay. It's totally okay. This is perfectly fair and balanced magic. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I will remind you that Brendan. Just had, untrue, sir. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Brendan had 10 gods on the battlefield that one time. I think that counts as unbalanced. Yeah, well, I bounced them. Karanos. Karanos and. He, yeah. Geo Golem. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Not a god. You're go. Okay. I have to discard down. This is my untap step. This is my upkeep step where I look at the top card of my library and I may put it in my graveyard. And if I have seven or more cards in my graveyard, I may transform Earth to search to escant. I'm fairly certain you got more than seven in there. Yep. Um, to be honest, we're going to graveyard that and flip this. That is now as can the sun can ruin. Uh, so I may. Re um, so now it can tap for blue, and I can tap three and tap it to look at the top four cards in my library, reveal a non-creature, non-land from among them, and put them in my hand, and the rest on the bottom. Cool. It's fine. I needed the mana. Draw. Uh, draw my card for the turn. Next, we're gonna. Do you have it? No. Aw. Not even close. I think you, I mean, you are kind of close. Even if you don't have it. You're pretty it. close. I, I am close no matter what. Close. It's um, a very tight game. We're going to do search for so Skanta. <laughs> Never didn't have it. Reveal this in sorcery. Ooh, okay. That's not bad. That can, uh, that can get you a thing in your deck and you generate three black off of that. You dark ritual off of it, basically. It's like a demonic tutor. Yeah. If you use the mana. Um, it's whether or not... It's very good. Problem is, is it puts it in my hand and I have to tap five mana to use it, which yeah. means I'm not cashing out today. <clears throat> yeah, which means whatever you get would have to use the black mana. If you wanted to play it. Well, yeah. Unless I have like other options or something. I mean, anyway, we're playing it. Talk about. All right, dark petition. Three black flooding. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna stop it. We're gonna stop it. <laughs> we're not. Um, you can grab any card in your deck, Drew. Just find one that's not bad. Go get it. I might be in your graveyard if that's the one that you're thinking of. Um, it's not. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Um, if it, we're gonna get animate dead. Cool. You, you don't even right. have to tell us. Oh, um, I do because I'm playing it. Fair. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. It goes on any creature in any minute. Eh? Yep. Um, so we're also going to be looking through your bin, Brendan. I'm well, just you know, what, you know what you want. There's only one that you need. Yeah. That's oh. the one. Yeah. Right. Yep. A really. You don't good want one. any of these ones because they're gods. Then you could get Bantu, Ilharg, Oketra, Zer, Rodas. You... Can I not target a god with this? Well, you can, it just it won't can. necessarily be a creature, because you want to have devotion. Okay, but well, does that mean he can no, yeah, the enchantment still Just, just hit the one that you want to uh, hit. You actually, hit no. More more. As soon as you get one without, uh, that doesn't have devotion, you'll you be able to put more it more. on the battlefield, and then it'll go, oh, I'm not a creature, and it'll fall off. So I don't think you can do uh, gods that doesn't have a devotion. I mean, you can, but it won't help you. Except for Ilharg. Yeah, Il Ilharg works for Il sure. Ilharg will most certainly work. Oh, does it have haste? Nope. No. Ah. Oh. No, but that does not matter. If you have a one with nothing in your hand, <laughs> since you have one black floating, you could go get Hazaret, discard your hand, and swing for five, <laughs> exactly. Uh, I know it before because it gives my soul my soul. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. Also, he's got a creature. Oh, yeah. Hazaret's in my hand. Yeah, it is. Um, I'm getting an Ilharg. Cool. Uh, it uh, is a five six. Yep. Um, we have one mana point floating, but I, I think I used hand. all my mana points. Bah. We're done. Cool. Untap. Upkeep draw. Ooh, interesting. Mm. Uh, what was that card? Did you have Karanos? Uh, no. He's not a creature. No, but it's, it still got the ability. No, oh, yeah. Really? yeah. Oh, yep. okay. Hit you for three? Yep. 23. Yep. Hmm. Oh. 
<laughs> what you thinking about, Brendan? I'm trying to think about why he wanted to go hard. Um, most likely to put Phoenix into play when he swings with them. But he could just play Phoenix. That too. Also true. Maybe he has a guy that, I don't know. Can Maybe he's just keeping his lines open because his hand sucks. <laughs> if That's, he actually uh, has a defender with power, Ilhard will put it in tapped in attacking. True. <laughs> <laughs> I, did, I did not know this. Yeah, so if you've got like a 5-6 defender and you're like, well, he's only got one blocker. <laughs> well, it can happen. He has one of those weird gargoyles. Yeah, because there's uh, some stuff you can do with uh, Alicia and Wall of Blood. Because Wall of Blood lets you pay one life to give it 1-1. One, one. Wall of Blood. And Alicia oh. brings it back tapped and attacking. So you bring back the Wall of Blood and you're like, I'll pay all my life. Uh, swing with Dude Golem. Okay, how much? Uh, six. Yep. And if it hits you, he gets the Dude's Commander. Yeah, you. he does. Yep. Um, it will hit either, even if you block. Yes, oh, right, it has Trample? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, okay. I'm taking six. Okay. Uh, more fun down in. to 17. Do you still have to pay the tax or no? Nope. Really? Yep. It's coming to a player, you may cast your commander from your command zone without paying its mana cost. You, oh, you still have to pay the additional cost. Okay. Uh, one floating. All right. And... <laughs> I guess the one floating actually Phoenix. went away when you went out of combat, but... Oh, okay, never mind. I'll just have one then. Sure. <clears throat> that is not floating. It's just around. He's around. He's more of a sinking type of mana, really. He was never a good swimmer. He always tried his best, but whenever he just dropped him in the pool, it's just like a lead weight. He didn't even try. Afara? Just looked at me and like, Father, why have you done this? And I went, boy, I'm sorry, but you must learn. <laughs> he went, no, Father, it is you that must learn. For once. Nilia Karametra. Bringing all the boys back out. Yeah. More than more than uh, Bontu. I feel like we're going to stop doing that at some point. Stop doing what? That. What do you mean? No. Sorry? I forgot. Speak up. Erebos yeah. and Hazard. <laughs> uh, which ones are creatures? The yes. ones on the bottom. Bontu and Hazard are creatures. Oh. I had it wrong. That's unfortunate. Oh, wait, not had it right. Yeah. But neither can attack or block. <clears throat> yeah. Deliberately. Uh, Morophon can still block though. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Um, thank you for uh, clearing that up for me. Uh huh. Clear yourself. Okay, who's a creature? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Karametra's not a creature. That's not good. No, I don't think any of them are creatures. No. One, two, nope. Another creature. Here you go. Oh, oh, I got another turn. Yeah. You can if you can get a creature to swing in that's powerful enough, you can do that. You can just swing with it. You're gonna win. Um, uh, I don't think he can. No. Well, he's only got. You've got more fun. True. Unless he's got a big guy in his hand. Yeah. Unless like Phoenix doesn't have the power to do it, right? No, and he won't be a creature when he goes in either. Yeah. Um, so we're. No, that doesn't get you a creature card. Ooh, I draw a card on your turn. I, there's this is bad guys. Oh, uh, actually, Brendan, how many cards are in your library? Because you might be able to use your hideaway trigger. One, two, three, like four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 24. eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20 one, two, three, four, five, five, six. What did I tell you? I just 26. changed it. It's 26. It's 26. It's 26. What are you doing? We gotta wrap this shit up. No, we don't. <laughs> You have to wait for this me forever. This game is forever. I'm doing search to a scum. Card liberated, restart the game! <laughs> um, so from search, I'm getting Telemann performance. And yes, cool. I do have to tell you that, because I'm tapping five and playing Telemann performance. What does it do? Because we fished our wish. What does it do? Um, target opponent reveals cards from the top of his or her library until that player puts all on creature. A creature, yeah. Oh uh, yeah, I get the first creature. Yep, that's um, the first one, you get a Joda. So I get a Joda. Yep. Sweet. Usually you'd mill till you get a creature, but... Yep. Yep. Well, oh. That's unfortunate. Let's play this island. Cool. There I go? No. Okay. Not Give yet. me a minute. Yep. Hold on. <laughs> Give me a second here. <laughs> oh, those cracks are my elbows. You know what? We're taking it. Um, we're going to move to combat. Yep. And we're going to swing with... The raise, uh, he won't have devotion, will he? Doesn't matter. Phoenix will not. 
I guess I'm not going to. Go, you go. You can do it now. Yay. I have no options. Uh, draw a card. Reveal! It's a enchantment creature. Uh, Hell yeah. Hit you for three. Yep. Actually, I'm gonna hit you over three. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Hmm. We tried. <laughs> Might still be okay. Uh, Phoenix. I think a lot of these are becoming gods this turn and they become creatures I can swing. Yeah. Insta. Um. Boketra. Bogetti. And Heliod. So let's separate these into what can attack and what can't attack. Uh, these can attack. She can attack. Um, she can attack. It does not haste though? Nope. Uh, so these just Bantu? came into play. Bantu cannot attack, nothing died. Uh, Karamantra can attack. Yep. Karamantra's a creature. Uh, one, one, two, three. Six. Yep. Yeah. Freak is a, uh, fetch is a creature. I think that's it. One, two. Yeah, that might be it. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna pay. Oh, I see. Bantu. Hit myself for one. Um, Bold. So I stack another creature, scry one. Each opponent loses one life, and I gain a life. Okay. Lose a life, I gain a life. What creature are you attacking? Um, probably Heliod. Not a creature. Oh, okay, try. Um, Did anybody lose devotion from that? Oh, I think Karametra might have. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, Karametra would lose devotion if you uh, do that. No, no, no. Okay, Karametra still has seven. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. One, two, three, five, six. A far is not a creature. Okay. Yeah, it's probably not worth it to do that then. So far, gets the extra two in. But it might be it. Yeah, because he, he can't block Bantu at all. Oh, yeah, Bantu's mad, that's true. So we're going in with these guys. Okay. Uh, blocking and they're all, Geode they're all getting plus two, plus two. You're yep. blocking Geode Golem? Pretty much. Okay. So you're going to take. I think you're just dead, no yeah. matter how you block it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Because it's a lot of damage, because there are. All these guys are getting two, two. Six, eight. Yeah. 14. 7, 21. Yeah, oh, yeah, no, that's, total, that's totally dead. Dead. That's yeah, game. Yeah. All right, yep. oh, right. God wins. Game. What a game. So I had two rocks and Phoenix oh, left in my hand. Oh, I, I have been, I've been sitting on a rock and one sorcery for most of this yeah. game. I was so really it's, scared it's been you playing were game. I, 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 th I thought you had it. I thought I had yeah. it on Telman yeah. performance. I thought I was going to get was a any one. god Red. out of there. Joda just sacrificed himself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and then Joda shows up and is just like, I'm bad enough well, to be the same. Like, I, I thought you were going to get him enough with Telman performance to get the thing off the shell dock aisle and then bring back any card from your bin and just be like, fuck you. Well, yeah. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah. so, I, you know, I wasn't out there. There was a chance. Yeah, sacrificed himself for the greater good. Good game, guys. Good game, guys. I felt game. like I was out good for game. half of that game. Was... I think you were out for half of that game. Man, I was so excited, dude! I mean, you started attacking me with an 11 11 flying lifelinker. I mean, it's a bit I, spooky. I know, Karlov is pretty much the arch enemy. Every time that. you take this deck out, you like you have an 11 11 with lifelink on turn four, and then we all have to go, well, that's a problem. <laughs> and then you're like, oh, my commander's died seven times. Yeah. Why? But all these decks are really fun to play. Oh, yeah. yeah. 100%. This, is, this is definitely like the fun deck to play a game. I, well, most our meta is that, hopefully, yeah. right? I hope so. <laughs> well, we should probably cut it there. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for watching our episode, guys. Uh, there's going to be two more in this series, with our finale being the last one, because that's what a finale is. But yeah. yeah, that's how Turns you end out. something. So we're going to do a mid-season finale. Uh, yeah. no. <laughs> Stop making promises. Uh, <laughs> cool and I promise that every single uh, viewer will get a free foil of Ketra, so you know, there you go. 100%. Um, <laughs> also, uh, all Can of my shoes and... Uh, <laughs> all right, that one's fine. All of Brendan's socks. No! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's just how it goes. Someone's getting stinky. Uh, I don't know. No one's oh, getting somebody stinky. can get stinky. No one's getting stinky. Nobody's getting stinky? No one's getting stinky. I'm getting stinky. Okay. Fair. I'm not that. I'm just, I'm just kidding. I, I didn't I bring am. my deodorant. I mean, I'm just getting stinky. Understood. Yeah. I see what you mean. All right. That's it, everybody. <laughs> yeah. Take it easy. Bye. Take it easy. Bye. Bye. Bye.